The Port Aransas Arts Center has been in the community for over 25 years. They recently received a very large donation from one man. I'm Aaron Holly, your Port Aransas neighborhood reporter, and I'm going to tell you just why this local man dipped into his life savings to help the Arts Center. I'm 77. I have cancer and realize maybe I'm mortal after all. And uh, so I thought it'd be nice to share my success. Mark Grozy has lived in Port Aransas for his entire life, and he wants to give back to the town that has given him everything. First on his list is the Art Center. $650,000. He's kind of entrusted us to do what's best for the Port Aransas Art Center. Grozy's love for the Art Center goes way back. He used to run a place right down the street and would visit often. It's, it's more than just an art center. It's a, it's a gathering spot for this community. Like Mark, the people of Port Aransas love visiting the art center. Fluid art, acrylic paint. Now, the owners made an expansion plan to grow the art center over the next few years, all thanks to Grozy's donation. In the long term, there's two things that need to happen. We need to be able to retire our existing uh, mortgage on this existing building. And then secondly, an expansion of about 3,000 square feet. While Grossi's donation is going to be a huge help, he hopes he can inspire others to contribute as well. I hope that motivates others to, uh, whether they could give a dollar or give a million dollars, to support whatever causes they feel are important. The owners of the Art Center are extremely thankful for the donation. First thing was just wow. I mean, you know, no words can describe it. I've known Mark for the whole time I've lived in uh, Port A. Grossi may have paved the way, but the Art Center still needs all hands on deck for this project. See, once I was able to help financially on things, is that's the easy part for me. It's the volunteers that really do the heavy lifting. The Art Center's expansions are expected to happen within the next five years. In Port Aransas, Aaron Holly, Chris 6 News.